Hey y'all, Nerdcules here. Just finished my workout, which means it's time to wipe off that sweat and kick it with some new comics. This week was completely stacked with some killer books. So starting out here, we got Ultimate Spider-Man number two. This was one of the variant covers that came out. Absolutely gorgeous. Love it. And this series is so cool with an older Spider-Man. If you haven't checked it out yet, definitely one to pick up. We got Marvel, Superheroes, Secret Wars, Battle World. This one is awesome. I've been loving these covers, these kind of connecting covers just showing the chaos going on. Now we got a Spider Boy number four. I absolutely love this cover. I think it's so cool. I love kind of these elongated kind of elastic forms of Spider Boy. We got one of these Hildebrandt covers. They've been doing this across the covers lately and I love this Kingpin cover here, right? We got Luke, Luke Cage Gang War number three down there, but this is all these artwork that came out in the 90s, some watercolors, and I just love this. Just, you know, Kingpin towering over. You'd kind of see it from this standpoint. You're just down on the ground. I mean, that's that's perfect kingpin right there. Avengers Twilight number one. This is the variant holofoil virgin cover. Absolutely love it. Uh, this is just kind of older Avengers and definitely worth checking out. There are only two issues into this one. Blip Map Chapter 3, Fragments of the Machine here. These are very cool. We checked out one of these a couple of weeks ago. Finally, the piece de resistance for this week, we got Edge of Spider-Verse number one. There were a lot of awesome covers for this one. Uh, I loved this cover. I also couldn't help myself. I had to pick up this one, this kind of uh, 97 variant. I thought it was very cool. I love all this kind of throwback stuff to the early 90s. There's some very cool ones that are out there. This is just a huge book this week. The way the Spider-Verse books normally work is they kind of are a collection of short stories, but the reason you definitely want to pick them up is they always have some firsts. So. Uh, love this one. This Nakayama uh, cover here is really beautiful. But we open them up and it'll give you kind of a rundown of what's going on. So this one jumps right in. Of course, we have Wolverine, Weapon X, but Earth-72 up there, important, important to point out. And then it kind of gives you a rundown, right? Edge of Spider-Verse, what it's about, and then these three stories that we're going to cover. So we got Weapon 8 in New Toys, Spider-Bite, in Spider-Man 2099. So this book actually introduces Weapon 8, who's kind of perched up there uh, for the very first time. Brand new character. He is kind of a gnarly character. Uh, Marvel teased him a few weeks back, but he is kind of Spider-Man Wolverine combined. So uh, he's basically, you know, Weapon X before Weapon X. He's kind of the, the perfect form of it, so to speak. And so he's able to kind of hunt him down. But obviously, kind of this weird amalgam of an experimental kind of Spider-Man. Uh, you can see later, he's got like multiple eyes and just kind of twisted. And so, uh, really interesting character. And I, I think he's interesting how he kind of looks like Cyclops. I think that that's kind of cool too. So, Marvel definitely doing more to kind of bridge the X-Men into the larger uh, universe. Obviously, they've always been there, but now with uh, Deadpool, Wolverine, and we're going to start to see a lot more of the X-Men, I think they're going to start to have these crossovers way more often in comics. But uh, very cool. So, that's just, look at that. That's so gnarly. Look at his face. Oh, my gosh. Um, but that's just one of the stories in here worth picking up because of a first appearance ever. It's also... Um, kind of a reintroduction to Spider Bite, who is famous from across the Spider Verse. So, definitely worth picking up for that. Let me know in the comments what'd you pick up this week, what was cool, and what did you think of all of these Edge of Spider Verse comics. Until next time, high five, subscribe. Nerd